I'm Dr. Robert Kesky. I'm a breast cancer specialist at Arizona Breast Cancer Specialist. I've been in the Valley for a while now, taking care of women with breast cancer. Every day I wake up and I look forward to going to work because I know that that first woman that's gonna be sitting in front of me, I'm gonna be able to help and help in a very warm and caring way. And it gives me great joy to know that I'm gonna have an impact on that woman's life and the next patient and the next patient. And by the end of the day, I just feel totally privileged to do what I do as a breast cancer specialist. I have three daughters and I have two sons who may have daughters of their own, my granddaughters. And if this treatment survives the test of time and is as rich in data and successful results as we've seen to date, and this becomes the treatment of choice for breast cancer, then it could potentially affect my daughters as they grow older or my granddaughters maybe even after I'm passed. So the generations to come could have a huge impact by the research that we are doing today. And this sends a chill up my spine just as I'm talking to you today because that's my legacy. Breast cancer medicine has changed in the Phoenix area over the last 10 years. I give a lot of credit to Dr. Coral Quiet, who brought it here for the first time. She brought me to Phoenix, Arizona, and together we've built a program that is unsurpassed by anybody. We are the pioneers in the five-day treatment option for breast cancer. God willing, we're gonna cure cancer in the next 10 years. But the odds are, since cancer is so many different diseases, it's not one entity, that we are gonna be facing breast cancer 10 years from now. Well, I think that the future is customized care for that woman sitting in front of me. A cookbook treatment is not gonna be the treatment in our clinic today, and it's certainly not gonna be the treatment in our clinic 10 years from now. That woman sitting in front of me he has a different type of cancer, stage, grade. She has a different life outside of her cancer. She has a family, she has an employment, she has hobbies. I think that 10 years from now, we take all these different factors that form that woman sitting in front of me, and we take them into account in designing a treatment that is customized for her. Not just her cancer, but her life. If you or a family member or a friend are affected by breast cancer, we want you to know that we are going to be there for you. We are writing the book in breast cancer care.